Hi, this is Rick with Spiritual Quest and Tibetan Salts. A lot of you have been giving us some questions. And what we're here to do is teach you how to assemble your natural salt lamp. Now, obviously, for many of us, we've already done this. And we don't need these videos. But you have to remember, salt lamps are becoming more and more popular. And more and more people want to have a natural source of light and energy in their homes. What we have here is a Himalayan salt lamp. This is what we would call our medium. One of the things that we want you to know, which is not pictured here, is they come individually boxed. We wrap each one of our salt lamps so that they arrive in the same condition that they left the factory. Most companies don't do that. Now that's important because there's a long ocean voyage that these lamps take in order to get to us and then to you. What's important to notice is that salt is hydroscopic. It attracts moisture. Without the proper packaging, they will get soaking wet on the long voyage over and it will adulterate the actual original look. Please understand that we take this precaution so that our lamps are always seen as the top-notch lamp. Quality, there really is a difference. Our Himalayan salt lamps obviously come wrapped. There's one other important thing I want to show you, is that the natural salt will flake off when you get it, but we do include a moisture absorber in each and every lamp. This is an added expense for us, but what it does, it ensures that your lamps show up in the very same quality that they left the factory. And that's very important for you because what we want to do is show you exactly the quality that comes with every Himalayan salt lamp. One of the things that we always get questions on is our butterfly cord attachment. If you can see here, there's a butterfly cord attachment right here. These adjust so that you can properly attach it underneath the lamp. Every one of our lamps come with a bulb and cord attachment, which holds the bulb and the cord steady. The butterfly simply fits right in, clicks into place, just like so. If the butterfly, let me see if I can give you some more light. If the butterfly doesn't click into place, you may have to adjust the width of the butterfly attachment. Simply attach the lamp and you're ready to go. Now our medium salt lamps tend to be bigger than most people's largest. This lamp right here is almost six and a half pounds. Most people sell larges for the price of our mediums. Anyway, the most important thing we'd like you to understand is that the Himalayan salt lamp should last a lifetime. You don't want to put it near any running water or outside where it could get rained on. The lamp may need some cleaning. All you need to do is take a little damp cloth to the base once in a while and every once in a while wipe up around it. Now if the salt lamp is off and it's very, very humid out, you will see some water accumulate on the table or wherever you have it placed. Don't worry, that won't harm the salt lamp whatsoever. What we want you to know is that if you leave the lamp on, there won't be any water accumulating in most cases. Now Himalayan salt lamps do generate negative ions, or at least that's what we're told. Negative ions are generated very simply by the moisture evaporating off the surface of the salt. Negative ions create an oxygen-rich environment where your body can take in more oxygen and the benefits are unbelievable. Helps you to feel centered, calm, relaxed. Not to mention the color therapy. The color therapy is much like that of looking into a campfire. Think back to the last time you sat outside in a campfire and how you were mesmerized by the oranges, the reds, the yellows, the whites. The same thing happens in a salt lamp. This one we've gone ahead and attached with a dimmer switch. We suggest you ask about the dimmer. It is an upgrade from the normal on-off switch, but it'll allow you to take it all the way down and all the way up. Now, why do we say that? Because when we're sleeping, the Himalayan salt lamps, once our eyes are just, make the room awful bright. So it's important that we take the opportunity to give ourselves every chance to enjoy our salt lamps. The dimmer cord can really do that. Once again, this is Rick for How To with Himalayan Salt Lamps. We hope you enjoyed the tutorial. If you have any questions, please email us at customersupport at spiritualquest.com or you can go to the Contact Us tab. Once again, we also offer salt lamps in geometric shapes, all different sizes. We are wholesalers, retailers, and we can even help you import a large quantity. Thanks very much for stopping by today, and we hope to see you again.